Hello everyone and welcome to something a little bit different today. Today we are doing science pro tips with Grey Wolf. Uh, we are looking today at the complement system, which is an immunological cascade of events, which will result in what is known as the membrane attack complex, uh, which in the end will perforate cell walls and cell membranes, destroying invaders. Uh, we will be looking only today at the classical pathway. There is a lectin pathway and an alternate pathway, but the classical is the most commonly studied. So, it all starts off with an antibody, which we all know comes from B cells. Now this antibody will come into contact with C1Q. C1Q is going to activate C1R, and in turn C1S will turn on. Next, C1S is going to work on both C2 and C4. C2 and C4 are both going to split into an A and a B. So at the end of this step, we have C2A, C2B, C4A, and C4B. Next, C2A and C4B are going to come together to make what is called C3 convertase. C3 convertase is going to take C3 and work as a catalyst, catalyzing the reaction which breaks C3 into C3A and C3B. Now, C2B, C4B, and C3B. These three proteins are going to come together and make C5 convertase. Now, C5 convertase, if you could guess, it's going to work just like C3 convertase, except on C5 and it is going to break C5 into two new proteins, C5A and C5B. C5B is going to continue the chain and come together with C6, C7, C8, and C9. Not just one C9, however, there are going to be several of them arranged in a ring-like structure. This all together, C5B, C6, C7, and C8, as well as the several C9, will form the Membrane Attack Complex, or the MAC. Now this process also allows for opsonization, or the flagging of pathogens for phagocytosis, as well as inflammation. With C3A causing inflammation, C3B causing opsonization, and C5A causing inflammation. So, if you guys stuck with us through the entire process, congratulations! You earned yourself an internet cookie and a wonderful glass of milk. Thank you guys so much for watching this brand new start to a series, Science Pro Tips with Grey Wolf.